All right, what is up, guys? So I wanted to do a video on Final Fantasy VII Remake. Uh, might go back and make a whole bunch more because this is legit my childhood favorite game. Um, I haven't seen a lot of people talk about the memorial, and the people that I have seen talk about it on like Reddit and stuff, like they were complaining, like, "Oh, they think it's dumb. Like, it's like a amusement park ride where you like, you know, you go through and it, it showcases everything." I kind of enjoyed it. Like, I think it was cool to see more, like, lore. I feel like they could have definitely expanded on the lore a little more than they did. But I feel like, you know, they took so many years to finish this game. There's so many character models in there that they're just showing off just because they're like, hey, like, we put the time and effort and detail into this. Check it out. So we're going to cut through. We're going to go look at everything in the memorial break everything down and then we're gonna go to the cosmo theater and watch the uh the cut scene for the whole like new ancients scene so if you haven't gotten this far yet in the game you haven't gotten to this is chapter 16 when you're in shinra hq spoilers so don't look but anyway let's get into it bloop thanks dreams appreciate it Big golden statue, the president himself. Welcome to the Shinra building, our humble home. Oh, hell no! Here in the Memorial Museum, <laughs> you can learn all about our president, as well as the various divisions that make up the company. And of course, the city of Midgar and the miracle of Mako energy. Whatever takes your fancy, you're sure to learn something new. Yeah, yeah, shut up! And so basically, like, one state away, we have a place, it's a very popular place, Hershey Park, Pennsylvania, right? And, like, just, like, hearing, like, the voice, like, it just makes me feel like I'm on, like, the, the Hershey chocolate tour. So, I don't know what that says, but we have, like, a very old photo of, I guess, people that were working here. Over here... We have Man like very highly of simple tools. We got a wrench, two wrenches, like a, an old hammer, somebody working. Uh, this might be some kind of drill bit. I don't know. Um, some of this looks like a, like an oil rig kind of a deal. I don't really know what that is. Over here, uh, it's the mayor and the president, I guess, when he's a little younger. Uh, Shinra Electric Power Company. It, in grateful appreciation, I don't know what the rest says. I might be able to zoom in on it later, see what it says. We've got his gun over here, at least a replica. Gold pistol. It's kind of cool. And was that it? The president. Got his uh, cigars over here. So yeah. This is the first part. I really love the detail in the Shinra headquarters and just the... Like, look at that so cool. Alright, anyway, we'll go this way. There's nothing else in here. I think we get a movie in here. Hey everybody, how's the grand tour? I hope you're all enjoying yourselves. Wasn't so I'm gonna get an angle to this. Shinra and our esteemed president? And to get a peek at the president's mementos? That was super cool. Ah, Scarlet. Mmm. <laughs> I don't know if you like if you played the Honey Bee in and like peep yeah, through the the keyholes. <laughs> As a Palmer, he's in there like chasing one of the Honey Bee in girls with a net. Oh, that's great. <laughs> I hope you're ready to be amazed because you simply won't believe all the exciting adventures we have here. All right, let's keep it rolling. These all look so We've destroyed a bunch of them already. Business division exhibit. We got Scarlet over here. You guys recognize these advanced weaponry. All right, let's see what this has to the say. The advanced weaponry exhibit is currently undergoing maintenance. We apologize for the inconvenience. Boo. Yeah, I feel like they could have 
expand it on lore a bit. I mean, like, this way we get to actually see the models walk around them without, you know, being attacked by them. Which is pretty cool. Space and aeronautics. Good old Palmer. What? What? Read this? This paper right here? Give me a moment. Welcome to the Shinra building. The Space and Aeronautics Division has taken rocket systems developed for military applications and adapted them to a different purpose. The search for new precious resources in the infinite reaches of space. That being said, since we have plenty of Mako at the present, those plans are currently on hold. It's a bit of a shame, really. All right, so that's all Palmer has to say. We have like a rocket over here. A nice potted plant. Uh, research and development. We have, is this Hojo? Uh, welcome to Shinra headquarters. My duties as director of research and development are in all likelihood far beyond your ability <laughs> to comprehend. Rude. I mean, he's got a point, though. So there will be no presentation, as it would be a waste of my time and yours. But rest assured, we are making great strides. Albeit not at this particular moment, because I'm filming this rubbish instead. I believe I've wasted enough of my precious time as it is. Science waits for no one after all. So, good day. I mean, you can't get mad at him. It's a smart man. We have some models of the Shinra shoulders, Shinra shoulders, Shinra soldiers, public security. Let's the go. public security exhibit is currently oh, undergoing maintenance. Hedegar. We apologize for the inconvenience. Okay, well, anyway, we have the crappy soldiers, uh, brown vest. We got the riot boys over here. Got a motorcycle. Man, I hate these guys. I hate them with a passion. It's cool to see them in this remake, though, and how they did that. They just freaking... That's yeah, just insane. Uh, Sector 8 over here, we got some kind of, like, sketch. This, you remember from Sector 5 slums, or, like, the road to, you know, Wall Market, whatever you want to call it. Got some Mako energy tanks over here and urban planning. Good old Neo Midgar. Welcome to the Shinra building. Our mission here at Urban Planning is to supply the residents of Midgar with energy created from Mako. We also take pride in maintaining public infrastructure, the pillars and railways that run all throughout the city. Currently, we are working to construct an intraplate expressway. When this project has been completed, it will provide much easier access to numerous locations all across Midgar. We appreciate your patience and understanding in the meantime. All right, so that's all Reeve has to say. Now, if you've beaten the remake, you know that we've completely changed Destiny and Zack is now alive, uh, just everything kind of changed. So is it possible that we are going to see Neo Midgar actually built at some point in the remake? Who knows? Who knows? All right, next. You gonna play? Yeah. Barrett, move. You enjoyed learning about our division. And the wonderful ideas and solutions that are produced to benefit us all. Here at Shinra, we strive to ensure the safety of all residents around the clock.
exhibit will teach you all about the miracle of Mako energy and our reactors, as well as the city of Midgar itself. So come on! Alright. This is Midgar, our home, recreated in one ten thousandth scale. As you can see here, the eight Mako reactors form a ring around the center of our city and keep Midgar running day and night. The Mako which flows beneath our feet is a truly limitless resource. At Shinra, we have developed technologies to extract it and transform it into the fuel and electricity that powers everything we do. Thanks to the miracle of Mako energy, our lives are richer and better than ever before. Mako keeps our lights on at night and made Midgar into the city that never sleeps. A triumph of technology and testament to man's potential. Nothing but a bunch of lies! Except that Mako has made people's lives better. It's made people blind. Blind to the cold hard truth. Even I used to buy into their bullshit. Remembering that makes me even madder. So it's cool to see this because if you remember in the original, you had to go collect the pieces and kind of piece it back together. And here you just have the full thing. So that's all there is in this room. I like, you know, the little wiring they have. It's a cool touch. It's just the, the whole Shinra HQ, and it just looks so, like, look at the... Somebody's in here polishing these floors. I think that was the end of the tour. Congratulations! You yeah. can call yourself a proud Shinra scholar! Now, moving along. Next, you'll learn about our progress in advanced science and technology. Please proceed to the 61st floor, the Visual Entertainment Hall. Time for the Cosmo Theater. Welcome to the Visual Entertainment Hall, where we showcase Shinra's cutting-edge technology. Through an immersive visual and audio experience, please relax and enjoy the show. Just the the eerie music and that just it gives me like the vibe of like a the where Genova was being held at. So, going in here, I'm sure if you've already gone through this, um, kind of gives you the vibe of the planetarium in Cosmo Canyon and the way like everything like comes at you and like flies past you and stuff. So we're gonna go in here. We're gonna watch a cinematic, and that's gonna be the end of the tour. So sit back and enjoy, guys. Somehow they learned of the great reservoir of energy pulsing beneath their feet. And once they had, the ancients developed the means to harness this bountiful energy and bend it to their will. The fruits of their labors have survived to this very day in the form of certain kinds of materia. Their scripture, too, has endured. We who are born of the planet, with her we speak, her flesh we shape. Unto her promised land shall we one day return. By her loving grace and providence, may we take our place in paradise. Alas, the ancients themselves are long gone. 
2,000 years ago, a meteor brought an end to their civilization. <laughs> but before their fiery end, did the ancients find their promised land? Even now, we have only to wonder. Times have changed, and the Shinra Electric Power Company is committed to changing and evolving with them. Like the ancients, we've harnessed the power of Mako. Are they out there watching us, waiting for us to join them in some blessed corner of the world? A green inverted land where boundless Mako energy will provide for our every need. Shinra is working for you to fulfill the hope of the ancients and lead us to that promised land. We shall not rest until our dream is realized. Oh dear, a man of my refined taste, running out of butter. <laughs> Short of its proper accompaniment, this tea might as well be boiled pond water. <laughs> there he is! <laughs> yeah, um, quite, quite a crazy vision to see into no. what is potentially the <laughs> end <laughs> of the, you know, the first game. Crazy like, ass thing made me want to uh, And not just because of the presentation, but the content too. Ought to come with a warning. That ain't for kids. That wasn't just a movie. That huge meteor. What was that about? Like I said, nothing you should show a kid. But yeah, so that's the Cosmo Theater. That's the Shinra Museum tour. As everything I thought it was kind of cool to walk through and see everything and then you know play a video of the ancients that we've never seen before and then you know if you've already completed the game you know that destiny has changed and all that good stuff so for them to show meteor here like what's the significance like you know it showed like Tifa obviously like I guess being killed by Sephiroth but like when that's happening we're way out in you know for the northern part of the map in that freaking crater so it's like I, who knows what's gonna happen like the story could be changed who knows there's so much speculation out there we're just gonna have to wait and see but anyway guys hope you enjoyed this video i just wanted to showcase that because i thought it was pretty cool and uh i'm probably gonna go i've already beaten most of the stuff in hard mode uh at least like the shinra uh battle simulation stuff uh i still have to do bahamut stuff i'm definitely gonna do a video on that and, like my material setups um kind of give you guys uh, some help on that if you need it because uh, it's not easy but anyway guys if you enjoyed that video thumbs up for me hit the subscribe button and I will see you guys on the next one